Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mengs and I welcome you guys back to Let's Play Wargroove. We are about to continue on our journey. The Dashing General. Having fallen to Nuru, the Heavensong border soldiers call in their commander, who I think is like probably one of the worst commanders in Wargroove at the moment. <laughs> I demand that you leave these lands. We will not stand for aggression on our sovereign border. Especially from the Florin savages that accompany you. You little... Who are you? My name is Ryota. I command the Heavensong border forces. How about you command them to cool it? Who are you to demand that of me? This is Nero of the Gloomwoods. But I'm Mercia, Queen of Cherrystone. Truly, why would the Queen of Cherrystone align herself with such poor company? Okay, that's it. I'm going to wipe that smirk off your pretty little face. So the rose blooms and reveals its true colors. True arms, then. I'm not just going to let you attack Nuru. You'll have to go through me. Alright, so more misunderstandings, apparently. You have threatened the safety of Heavensong. You're making a huge mistake. I believe not. I know that the Florin are capable of, and I will not take any risks. Alright, so we gotta go defeat Ryota. So this guy, uh, I tried to play a little bit with him. Where is he? Is he even on this map? Yeah, there he is. His, his power is really weird. I, I know that there's gonna be a balance patch coming up. Like, he can dash through enemies and do damage as he goes. And I think the new balance patch will allow him to also dash through his allies, but do no damage to them. So he can kind of, like, use his own units to move around. But even if he can do that... He's just so hard to use, and it's my my initial problem with Ryota's power is that he it doesn't do enough damage to justify using it. It does like what 35% of his maximum damage. That's nothing. That's like three hit points of an infantry. It's just not great, uh, and it also often places him in very risky situations because he can't move after using it. So, anyway, let's take a look at this map. So he has a lot of shit. Let's just go and start capturing shit, shall we? So we have a barrack here that we definitely want to get, uh, take on the, well, we can't take it on the first turn. But what we can do is we can use the wagon to transport Mercia over here. And then we can transport this ranger for the next turn. Here we go, and we can take this village with our rangers. Oh my god, did you guys see that? Yeah, there's, so there, the patch, the new patch has actually struck, and I don't know if it's actually changed Ryota. That would actually, I need to actually go read up on the patch notes, but, uh, uh there is an end turn confirmation, so this is really cool. Now, it, I'm actually gonna turn off... Let's see, I'm gonna turn off automatically end turn here, just to show you guys. This is actually really cool. So, if I click end turn, it says, are you sure you want to end your turn? Oh my god, thank you! Thank you! It's about fucking time. Well, did it, did it? No, they haven't changed the positioning of the end turn button, though, but with this thing, they don't really need to do that, so... Thank God about that. I don't know. I, I actually I should have read up on the on the patch notes before I recorded this episode. I kind of regret that a little bit right now. Um, but yeah, they they really sped up the game as you can see when you hold in the mouse button, and you also see this. You can also skip animations much faster now. Look at this. Oh wait, what? Apparently, if you hold the mouse button in, you just skip the animation from the start. Oh my God, that's a huge quality of life improvement right there. That's actually wonderful. I love that. Okay, so what if we just place the ranger here then? And line the knight up for a charge. Oh, I should probably get this building as well. Uh, let's see... Uh, rangers are so freaking slow, man. Let's just get an alchemist going, shall we? There you go. I d I'm probably gonna turn that off now though. Oh wait, wait, where did my animations go? Did I turn animations off? Actually, I, I may have turned animations off accidentally. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Let's see. Uh, mission. Sorry. Overview. Nope. God damn it. It's uh, mission options. That's how you find it. Let's see. Combat animation. Yeah, I don't know why it was set to never. Uh, automatically end turn. Sure. I don't think I'm going to need an end of turn confirmation because um, I'm not playing on the Switch. This is only a problem when you play on the Switch. When you don't play on the Switch, this is not... Because on the Switch, you press AA really quick for that. But, oh my god, see that new cancel animation? That's so good. Oh my god, look at that. You can, like, cancel it immediately now if you wanted to. That's wonderful. Thank you. The game really needed this. Of course, I'm not gonna, like, go and cancel every single animation, because I know you guys really like the animations, but still, this is absolutely wonderful. 
Okay, so we have a knight and a wizard there. I'm gonna try and put a lot of pressure on that barracks if I can. Let's get some pikemen into action as well. And if we put the wagon here, we can load that guy in next turn. Let's see, what do we have here? We have some battle pups. Let's get the ranger a little bit closer to the border as well. We can, I, yeah, we, um, or sorry, alchemists, they don't necessarily trade trade very favorably against infantry, but I still want to take this building, so. And I think that will be it. Alright, here we go. Uh, it's not a charge. No, but I am on a bridge. I'm gonna take a lot of damage. But I'm gonna deal a lot of damage too. Luckily, Mercy can heal herself with her CO power, so this shouldn't be a big deal. Now, this is gonna suck for me. Oh, yeah. Wizards on roads are not particularly great. So, I wonder if Ryota's actually gonna move into combat. No, he's playing passively, as the AI tends to do with its commander. Really weird. Okay, so I got my healing aura now. Also, I got a Pepsi Max. Mm. Now, I guess what I can do is I can move over here. Um, it would be nice if... Wait. Oh, wait. Can I actually... Oh, wow. Look, I can actually attack these guys. But then I'm going to get attacked next turn, and that would suck. I think what I am going to do is I'm going to let those harpies attack me. And then I think, actually, if I deal with these knights now with Marcia then I should actually be able to charge the barracks and one-shot it, and then I can capture it with Mercy on next turn. Although I would like to heal, I think it's better to save up for a little bit of a more more of a cost-effective heal. Uh, yeah, this is... Uh, no, it wasn't a charge. We'll need to be... If I want to charge, I'll need to move my knight here. Which means th the Harpy might attack me, but I'm actually fine with that. Or, if I'm smart, I'll block it off with a Pikeman, like so. Now I gotta protect... Uh, let's see, what if I... I'm actually going to build a trebuchet here. There we go. Protecting my borders. Like Trump. Uh, let's see. Alright, I'll go and capture this. God, I love these new skip animations. They're so fucking great. So much easier to play Wargroove right now. Uh, what can we do here? I, Not a whole lot. I mean, we can put our wizards in the forest so that they'll crit. And then I guess we'll place our rangers here. And just get some more pikemen. There we go. Alright, yeah, we have a tower, but... I don't really have the cash to build an... Okay, right, they're going for my commander. Of course they are. Of course they are. Gotta be a little bit careful there, though. She's getting pretty low. Oh, looks like Ryota's moving down. That's pretty good. Oh, here we go. They'd be attacking our buildings. This shouldn't be a kill, though. No. One thing you gotta notice about villages is that they get d defense based on the terrain that they're on. Uh, so if you have, for example, there's sometimes you'll see villages on roads, and they'll have less defense than villages on plains. I'm not sure if villages can be on forests, I haven't seen that yet, but I think they might be? I'm not sure, though. But yeah, the AI loves going for buildings, too. Okay, so now we can actually just, like, one-shot the barracks. Um, I think it's worth it. I can't capture it. But even if they take it back, I can just take it back again. Heed my advice and turn back Queen of Cherry Stone. I'm sorry, but I can't. Too bad for you, then. Okay, so... I gotta, I gotta admit, I sort of want to use my healing. Because if I do that, I can kill this guy. Uh, but at the same time, let's see how, far, how long is her healing aura. Yeah, it has to be centered on her, so I have to move my wagon if I want to do that. I think I'm gonna go do it. Also, I wanna check if it targets buildings. I actually haven't seen this yet. Uh, no, it does not target buildings. I would have been pretty OP if it did. But I think a healing aura like that is good if it ends up with a harpy getting killed. Or an aeronaut, I suppose is the proper term that we call them now. As you can see, rangers are not great against uh, flying units if they have to move first. They're probably gonna get killed next turn. So let's protect our wizards, and send in more infantry to camp that barrack. Actually, we need some help over here. Uh, yeah, we need some help here. Let's see, which one of these should be attacked? Probably this guy. The, o the other infantry only has four hit points, so I don't think he can really do a whole lot. 
And look at that, they're dumb and placing their rangers in range of my wizard, so that's great. That's a cost-effective engagement, even if the wizard ends up dying. And then we can't attack that guy, but we gotta stay out of range of the battle pop. Uh, but I think probably a good thing to do right now, maybe a knight. Uh, no, that knight will get targeted by the ballista, so let's just build a pikeman instead. Uh, we can actually afford a, an aeronaut. Sure, let's do that. Might actually build a witch at some point. There we go. Might as well send this wizard over here. Alright, what is Ryota going to do? Probably going to... Oh, shit! He just built a dragon. Shit, 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 shit. Yeah, I should have saved up for a witch instead. Uh, I gotta get Mercy off the road, that's for sure. Or else the dragon is going to crit me. Oh, well. Ryota's running away. Okay. Fine with me. Ah, oh, this is gonna sting. Wait, do dogs one-shot rangers on roads? I don't think they do. No, barely. Or almost. Also, I just noticed Ryota is smiling. Is that a new thing they added? I'm pretty sure... Wait, was he smiling? Have they added facial expressions to the different commanders? Or is that something that was always there that I just missed out on? Okay, I'm gonna go check now. Uh, yeah, cause now... Yeah, look at that, look! Their facial expression changes! I, it, that is new! That is new, right? I'm pretty sure that has not been a thing before. Two, three, four, five... Uh... Hmm... I am, like, 99% sure that they didn't used to do that. Yeah, he's getting all mad! That's so cool, I love it. Taking a page out of Advanced Wars 1. I'm pretty sure I would have noticed it if it happened before. Uh, anyway, yeah, I wanna... Shit, this dragon is gonna... Just gotta make sure Mercy has at full health. Uh, can I make these dogs run away? I don't think I can, no. Uh, let's see. Well, I definitely gotta... In oh, wait, what? Oh, shit, I already have a pikeman here. Let's see, let's just get these guys out of the way. And I guess we can do... Can move up here and reinforce. So we can get rid of these guys by moving forward and just shooting them out. And we should wait. What? Oh fuck! They didn't die. All right. I guess we'll just go finish off these guys then. No fuck! It didn't work. Shit. Ah oh, man. Okay. Let's just run away. There's nothing we do here is really cost effective. Let's just get another alchemist. I mean, aeronauts can counter dragons. It's just they don't do all that much damage to them. So hopefully we should be fine here. Mm-hmm. All right. Let's see what the dragon does. Uh, the dragon is going for my knights. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's a one-shot. I love how they have a little flame shower in their mouth. That's fucking adorable. Uh, okay, my rangers died. My, my wizards died as well. Okay, well, we have wizards in range, so maybe we just get another another alchemist up. I think we do that. I think we, we just push for the stronghold. Don't you guys think that? Yeah, I think that's what we want to do here. We'll do this, and if the dragon attacks us, we'll kill it with the wizard. If Ryota's gonna be, like, super defensive, then I'll, I'll just target his nerf stronghold. And I don't know why he thought this was a good idea. <laughs> the AI doesn't play all that well sometimes. Schmack. Uh, okay, so yeah, I'll just move the wizard down here and yeah, I'll keep the rangers here. Let's see, we have sun tomorrow. So that's pretty good. And yeah, I'll just like keep keep a defensive line here just to prevent these guys from attacking me. And then I'll just build more units to deal with uh, whatever air units they're sending my way. I'm pretty sure the dragon will go for Mercia. Yeah, he will. I'm not sure if I'll get to crit him, but... I mean, I have four defense from the mountains, so it's not a whole lot that dragon can do against my commander. Okay, so let's see. Can we... No, we can't... Wait. Can we reach the mountain? That would be nice. But I don't think we can, no, we can't. 
Uh, we can do 85% damage though. That's pretty good. Yeah, we can we can effectively neutralize that dragon. Zoo. It also, I'm not sure if they have, but it seems like the regular animations are playing a little bit faster as well. There seems to be, like, less of a delay. So, if that's the case, then that's great. I love it. Okay, we can't actually afford a witch. I'm gonna get one, because they can reach the front lines pretty fast. So, we'll place the treb here. We'll place a little pikeman bait here. And yeah, good luck uh, crossing that bridge. I mean, I might cross it soon if they, they keep playing defensively, so... And I'm gonna send my wagon back to go pick up the pikeman next turn. Actually, I think I won't be able to. But yeah, we'll start attacking this village. Harass his income a little bit. And I think that will be it for my turn. Alright, let's see what he does. Oh, shit. Ooh, I'm not gonna die now, am I? Uh, I'm on a road, I just realized. Uh, oh, this is gonna be close. Uh-oh. I don't think this is gonna do all that much. Uh-oh. Uh, okay, okay. Interesting. I thought the- Oh no, the dragon can't attack me, because I'm, I'm over- Oh, right, 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 right. I just realized. When walls, flying units can't fly over walls for whatever reason. Because of logic, because of facts and logic. It's like, nope, it's a wall, it can't fly over it. So yeah, that, I was actually safe there, but if the dragon could go for me, I probably would have died. So that was pretty reckless. Uh, in fact, that was so reckless that... I'm not even sure if a uh, healing aura is gonna bring me to safety here. I can at least crit these knights, which is pretty nice. Um, yeah, I think I, I'll definitely go back and heal. I can't... You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna load this wagon up with a wizard. And then we're gonna... I really wanna get off the road. Alright, let's heal. There is also a golem over there, which leads me to believe that we, um, we definitely need to sort off. But well, we do have our commander. Commanders can deal with golems pretty effectively. And we can do this. Uh, do we want to, though? No, I, I don't think we want to. I think we just want to take this village. But yeah, we gotta get a knight's... If I can charge the golem... Wait. If he goes down here... One, two, three, four, five, six. So one, one, two, three, four, five... No. One, two, three, four, five. No, okay. So regardless of where I build the knight, I'm not gonna be able to crit the golem, which kind of sucks. But we do have aeronauts coming in. Yeah, you know what? Looks like he's sort of like put chickening out on this side. So I'm just gonna start moving my units across the bridge. Looks like he's trying to push over here, which is not gonna go all that well for him, I think. Let's just get a swordsman. Move our witch. I'm not sure if these pikemen will even reach the front lines in time. Alright, let's see what Ryota does now. Well, he's gonna crit my pikemen, first and foremost. That is actually a one-shot. And this is gonna hurt like hell, too. Ugh. But I think if I just focus everything I have... Okay, fuck, I forgot about the doggies. Okay, Ryota still being weird. Yeah, he's going for the buildings over here, so I should probably just... Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, if I set up the treb here, then I crit the barracks next turn. And I think that's a kill, actually. I'm pretty sure that is a kill. So, we can use Mercia. We should probably see if we can kill a unit with Mercia. That golem is going to hurt, but there's not a lot I can do about that at the moment. We'll attack like this. I think if I do that... Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, whoops. Okay. I vastly overestimated the wizards, apparently. Let's just go and heal up. I think this is a good crit, though. 38 damage from a, from a wizard. I... I think we should take this engagement. 
The golem literally costs three times as much as the wizards. Kaboosh. And we can use our aeronaut as well. And it's probably time to get some of these pikemen to the front lines as well. Let's see, what if we do... If we move our wagon all the way back here. We can also build another knight. And the switch. There's no more air units for it to kill at this point. Actually, no, there's an aeronaut next to a stronghold, so that's good. Gotta be careful about the ballista, though. And again, AI just loves targeting your commanders. I think this might kill them, because they're on our own. Yep. Oh, close. I think that was literally because of bad luck. Oh, that golem is gonna crit me now. So yeah, whenever golems are below 4 hit HP, they hit us hard. Ah, no, a little bit less hard. No, wait, actually, he might have been above crit range. Because he needs to be 4 or lower, so that's 40%. So even if they're on 4 HP, if they are, like, at 44, for example, then the, they won't crit, so... You need to actually be very mindful of their actual hit points. But now that golem is critting me, but that's fine, because I can kill it now. Um, in fact, I'm tempted to just rush forward here. Okay, how, how can we best do this? Well, we need to get rid of this guy. Um, we can do 27 damage. We can just kill him with uh, with Mercia. And that'll probably get our groove up, I think. Because we've killed two units. Uh, not quite. 80%. Close enough. I do not wish to harm you or your soldiers further, but if you refuse to use this lance, I will have no choice. We can't leave. We have to get to the Imperial City. I will not let the Florum pass. Then I can't back down. So I think that the reason why he's so aggressive towards us is because he got attacked by Sedge or something. That's that's my theory. Sedge is edgy. Alright, let's go and uh, set up a crit next turn. With our pikemen. And I think I'm just gonna keep building knights. I love knights, man. I, I use knights so often in multiplayer games. It's so much fun. Um, I just love setting up charges and like making cool tactical plays with them. They are so much fun to use. Alright, well, we got the barracks. Let's go take it over. They'll probably take it back, but I don't care. Uh, I'm just gonna keep my wizards here, I think. Actually, you know what I can do? No, I don't have enough money to heal. He can't attack me, so we should just, like, go back and... Actually, you know what? Let's reinforce. And I think that's it. I think I can probably kill a stronghold next turn if he doesn't do anything. Oh, he just... He built... Oh, god fucking damn it. I completely forgot about that stupid ballista. Yeah, that was a bit dumb. Shouldn't have done that. Rip wizards. But that barrack is mine now, so... Okay, I sort of underestimated the Ryota a little bit. A little bit. But I can still kill these guys with my wizard, so that's fine. Okay, will he attack now, though? That's the, that's the big question. Well, I can kill his barrack. He might just take it back, but that means no more units is coming out of that thing. In, in fact, I, I've i taken down every single one of his production facilities right now. Which is kind of funny. And I can crit these guys. Kill these guys. And yeah, let's just move the treb in. Why not? Now we can build another knight. And if we... I wonder if it's better to set up a crit or attack with two. Hmm. I think if I attacked with both of them, I probably would have got gotten the building down by now. Oh well. Alright, just keeping my commander on full health to be safe. You never know, right? <laughs> no, they're attacking. I, I actually don't think these guys can kill that building. And I'm just gonna cock block with my wagon. Might as well. It's not like it can be used for a lot of productive things anymore. His uh, stronghold is hidden behind some forests, though, so it's gonna be a little bit hard for me to take it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, wait, did he just... Oh, he's building air units. That's what he's doing. Yeah, look, he's just... He's just losing both of his units trying to attack my village. That's hilarious. 
Oh, that is super cute. Alright, let's hex. Why not, right? Joop. Uh, so, I can go and take his building, and I think I will do that. Just gonna make sure I don't get my, uh, don't get my commander killed, and we should be fine. There we go. Okay, yeah. Literally just Ryota and a knight left. Oh, uh, and this guy, of course. Uh, but this is fine, because I can use my, uh, I can use my healing aura now. Healing Aura! And that should be the end of that night. So yeah, it's just Ryota and, <laughs> and the Harpy left. I think it's so much easier to call them Harpies. I know a lot of people get a little bit triggered when I do that. But I think it's a nicer name. Harpy. It's easier to say. Aeronaut sounds so weird and convoluted. Like, Aeronauts? Who wants to say that, am I right? Aeronauts. The uh, Virgin Aeronaut versus the Chad Harpy. Alright, will Ryota... I nope, he's just running away and he just built the dragon as well, so... Yeah, he's... Oh wait, that's gonna be a one-shot. Wait... Oh no, they're injured, that's why. Yeah, I guess when he only has, uh, when he only has like, a single tower left, then this is how it's gonna be. <laughs> I think we have our Alchemists in range. Yeah, we do. There we go. And, uh, well, let's just set up a crit. I, I don't think we can actually kill... Let's see, one... Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so if we place our treb here... This might actually force Ryota to attack us, but we will, we will win next turn regardless, so... Because he's the only one who's left at this point. Let's just put a wagon in front of him. Let's be extra BM. <laughs> Let's build two trebs. Now, I don't actually know if you get increased the score for doing this. Someone could explain me how scoring works, that'd be good. Someone has already pointed it out, but I'm not sure how correct their comment was. Alright, will Ryota actually attack a wagon? Nope, he won't. He won't even attack the wagon. Okay, so Treb actually doesn't one-shot a stronghold even when it, when it crits. Good to know. I guess the stronghold is just a lot harder to kill. Yeah. Phew! We did it! You are a great commander, Queen Mercia. But the Nation of Heavensong will not yield to you. Please, just listen. That's not what we want. We didn't mean any harm in coming here. We simply wish to speak with Empress Tenry. The Empress? Oh no. Hey, that's my mom you're talking about. <laughs> Prince Koji. I saw you all fighting. I'm not gonna let these guys anywhere near my mom. Me and Tenko here won't let that happen. Okay, so we're gonna fight against that guy next turn. Why are the Heaven Zone commanders so trash though? Actually, Tenry is really good. Alright, so we unlocked additional lore about Ryota. So this is gonna be our next mission, guys. Ryota is defeated, but here comes Koji. Emmerich steps in to take on the plucky prince. Okay guys, hope you guys enjoyed this part. As always, give it a like and a comment, and uh, subscribe for more Wargroove. My name is Inmengs, and I shall see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Uh,